Today's video is to prepare you for Lesson 1.7, An Investigation into Lucy. The first thing that we're going to talk about is the evidence surrounding evolution or the change in the human population over time. We will be discussing taxonomic groups and how organisms are organized. The picture on the right shows the classification of Homo sapiens within the order primate. Hominins refer to organisms that fall in the family Hominidae. Hominins are erect walking primates that include modern humans and extinct human-like species. When we talk about evolution, evolution does not happen within a single organism over the span of its life. Evolution is the result in changes in populations of organisms or groups of individuals of the same species that live in the same place at the same time. Our investigation into early human-like species will raise questions about the missing link or the perceived gap in hominid evolution between early and more recent humans. Lots of evidence we will look at is in the form of fossils. Fossils are the preserved remains or traces of animals, plants, and other organisms from the remote past. As we talked about briefly in class, what fossils are preserved in or the shifts that happened in Earth to create the fossils can give us clues as to how that organism died. Transitional fossils are fossils that help to link past ancestral species and more recent descendant groups. You may be questioning how scientists know the age of certain fossils and also of skeletons like Lucy's. Scientists use radiometric dating as one method of deriving the age of an organism. Radiometric dating is a technique where isotopes of certain elements, especially carbon, are identified and their decay products are counted. When they count the decay products with the knowledge of the half-life in mind, they can identify how old an organism might be. The picture on the left is a picture of Lucy's fossil. We'll be looking at this more deeply tomorrow in class. On the right-hand side is a skeleton of a Homo sapien. As always, make sure to complete the research check found on the class website. Have a great day.